You're about to enter an unknown place. Okay. A place where reality and nightmare merge, where shadows hide secrets and fear is a constant presence. I'm used to that place. This is uncharted territory, a dimension not only of sight and sound, but of the mind. All right. It is the limbo between light and darkness, between reason and the irrational. Who's that? You find yourself in a shadowy spot that defies logic and distorts time and space. This is the scary shadow zone. This is scary shadow spot. Very excited. I can't wait. Oh, hey, who Welcome are you? to Scary Shadow Spot, where the ordinary dissolves and the unknown takes over. Right. Tonight we will immerse ourselves in the darkest recesses of the human mind, where the deepest fears and most painful memories hide behind every shadow. Okay. Our protagonist is Mark, Hi, Mark. an ordinary man carrying the burden of unbearable grief. A few days ago, Mark lost his beloved wife, Jane, in a tragic car accident. Very sad. An accident in which he was driving. Guilt and remorse have driven him to seek refuge in an old country house, a place that once promised hope and happiness. This house now abandoned and dusty, what harbors forgotten memories and dark secrets. As Mark tries to find some peace, he will discover that the shadows of the past are more alive than ever. What was that? Eerie sounds, fleeting visions, and a mysterious clock frozen at the time of the accident will accompany him on a journey that challenges reality itself. I see. But questions persist. What truly lies in this house? Who is the figure that appears and disappears among the shadows? And above all, is it possible that the nightmare Mark is experiencing is something more than just a trick of the mind? Possible. Get ready, viewers, to uncover the truth hiding in the shadow. Because in this dark corner of the world, the line between real and unreal is as thin as a thread. This is Scary Shadow Spot. What an intro. Man, get ready, viewers, yeah. Welcome to Scary Shadow Spot. Last farewell, guys. There we go. Rosary. I'll need that. Uh, matches. Candle. The pendulum clock seems to be in perfect working order. However, the time is stuck at 4.44. Ooh. That's me and my wife. I play as Mark. Remember that, guys. Oh. Can I... Hey... Pray. Okay, let's pray. I prayed. The door won't open. It seems to be blocked from the other side, okay? That's my wife. We lost her in the car accident. Very sad indeed. Okay, everything seems to be normal here. More candles. Yeah? What's that? What's... What's that? It looks like a painting has been removed. Okay, we need a painting. Missing painting. Okay. So we need the painting to open that clock as well. Block from the other side. Okay. What's that? A key? The shower is completely rusted and won't open. I need to find something to oil it. Oh, hi, my beautiful wife. You're dead now. Photo, blood dress. Oh, I have a photo now. Hello? Anybody in here? There's no light switch? I can't see anything. I'd rather go back to the attic when I find a flashlight. Okay, that's a good call. Okay. All right, doctor. That's not helpful. I'll pray. I don't have any rosaries to pray. Man. Anything down there? 
I gotta record. Am I good? Am I good? Let's put the painting right here. This should open. Uh, card. Ultrasound. Examine that. It's a tarot card, right? Or not? I don't know. I'm not sure if it's a tarot card or not. Hi, Gerard. Welcome back. Okay, let's go out. That looks inviting. Relax, bro. Look, everything is fine. No need to breathe like that. I got a match, but I don't have a candle. Hey there. One eight four zero. What is that? Maybe I should examine it carefully. The ear on the cover and the content seem to be important. Art history eighteen four zero. I left the key. Oh, there's a key. Oh my god. Office key. Okay, man. What? What's that? Ah. Found the office. Hello. Anyone here in my beautiful office? Oh. I remember this one. It's a... Uh, 1840. I don't know these ones yet. We'll find it though. Red candle? Yellow candle? No. What's that? Photo. Matches. Uh, okay. Red candle? Yellow candle? Let's listen to this one. some important things to help you manage what you are going through. First of all, I want you to pay attention to your mental state. It can be easily influenced by paranormal events, unknown sounds, and visions. If you feel overwhelmed, you might enter an anxiety state, making everything more difficult. Hey, Amon. You need to be careful not to reach the limit, as it could lead to severe consequences. you manage your mental health i have scattered crucifixes around the house when you interact with them you can get an idea of how you are doing if you find a rosary use these moments to pray i know you are a man of faith and i believe this can give you comfort anything else doctor finally if you have visions of aggressive figures I remember do. that you cannot fight them i can they are projections of your mind if you get too close to them, your mental state will worsen. Run or hide under a table, in a closet, or any other place that makes you feel safe and allows you to calm down. Anything else, Doctor? That's all for now. Okay. Remember, Mark, take everything one step at a time. Talk to you on the next record. Great talk, Doctor. What about this one? Hi, Mark. This is Dr. Will. I know you are going through a difficult time. The loss of a loved one can leave you with an immense void. Uh -huh. I want you to know that you are not alone on this journey. Your mind may play tricks on you, but it is important that you remain strong. I am very worried about you. 
In our last session, you gave me a lot to think about. I fear that you are not yet ready to face this truth. Your father allowed me to enter the house. I have left other recordings around and a series of puzzles to keep you engaged. It's a somewhat unconventional therapy, but if you follow my instructions to the letter, I am sure that your journey will benefit. We will talk again on the next record. Thanks, doctor. Let's uh, put this record away. Don't need that. And I would like to save the game here. Oh, this is open. This area is open now. Hi. Kitchen. Is that the time? Ooh. Oh my. I don't think I have the glass for that yet. Another photo. Country house. Nice. Are more candles. Perfect. Oh! Coming! Hold your horses! All of them! Hello? Hello? How are you? Good, good, good. It's been a while since we last spoke. Okay. I know this is a difficult time for you, but I want to know how you are. How is the preparation for the wake going? Please, call me if you need anything. I'm always here for you. Who are you again? I understand that it is extremely difficult and you don't feel like talking. But know that I am always close to you. I've tried to contact you several times, but you never answered. The fact that you did now makes me feel a little better. It's Don't locked. Wait until tomorrow to see the coffin for the first time. Why? What's the problem in that? I care about you. Uh, um, okay. <laughs> okay. I care about you. I think that's my mom or mother-in-law. I don't feel like talking to anyone right now. Guys, I'm also streaming this on YouTube. <laughs> So if you want, you can watch this on YouTube also. Wait a second. It seems all these busts need to be turned around. It's a painting. How do I do? Oh. I need a uh, something here, okay? Hey, Jean. Hi, Jean. Okay, I saw the coffin. Is that good? What's your YouTube name? I just posted the link there. It's the same, Fidisti. Uh, I need the code for this. What's the code, guys? Tell me the code. Another rosary. All right, doctor, tell me. Hi, Mark. It's Hi. Dr. Will again. I know. I'm glad you found this recording. I know the living room can be a place full of emotions right now. Seeing the coffin can reopen wounds that perhaps have never fully healed. I want you to know that even if it feels like everything is falling apart, you have the strength to get through this. Each puzzle you will find is designed to help you process your grief and find a new perspective. Each step brings you closer to the truth you need to face. Anything else? Now there's a small task for you. Okay. Search carefully in the living room. You will find an item that belonged to Jane. This item is locked in a box with a numeric combination. You will find the combination in the bedroom. Living room, Jane, numeric combination, bedroom. Got it. Anything else, doctor? We'll talk again on the next record. Great. See ya. You mean next session, right? <laughs> Alright, let's put this away.
Oh, it opens. Hammer. my fault you died well, let's go when it's turned around yes Jane oh, hi Jane don't eat me what do you want Hey, hey, you're not my wife. You're not my wife. Go away. Look at this. This guy's everywhere. He's taking over everything. Look at that. All right. I have the hammer. We can use this. Boom. Take that out. Peak. 7.20 is the time. Perfect. Don't be shy, guys. Okay. Child's room key. Hide under the table. I'm hiding. Oh, finally found it. Oh, another record. Hey, who's... Who's doing that? I hate clowns, man. Let me put a candle here and light the candle so we can see something. Great. I don't have eyes to insert. Strange painting. Flashlight. Look at that. Another coin. Another rosary. What do I need here? At least I have a flashlight now. Why did I say that? Is it gone? That was terrifying. It's time to light these candles. Hey Joey, welcome back. Joris, welcome back. this point 
What if I start praying in front of her? I have the rosary. Guys, I'm not following her on purpose. I don't have any other option. Maybe I can light a candle here. And then she will go away. There. Okay, it's going inside. It's my chance. I'm running away. Run. Run up there. See, that's what happens when you don't breathe and just do like... Uh, time to... Power is out. The fuse box is in attic. Oh boy. Okay, I'll save the game anyways, bro. Oh, I need to turn on the power first. So when power goes out, these things start to hunt me? Is that now? We need the car? <laughs> yeah, we need the car now. Oh, I didn't know that this game is so scary. Alright, here we go. woman yeah she's the one who's hunting me hey dear woman you up here what's that more rosaries oh I don't have enough candles I need to save my candles there's a tale of love and war, of a heart that couldn't let go. Shadows in the light, oh, they fade away. Whispering secrets of yesterday. In the dark, we hey. find our way. But the light, oh the light brings a brand new day. Where do you go? Lost in time, <laughs> the clocks run cold. Echoes of a You still there? Hi. I'll be right back. Okay, hold on. I did it. I can't believe it. I opened the coffin. Hey, Jane. Oh, hi. Wait, what? When the day is done and the night feels right, take a break, enjoy the light. Lonely strike, it's, it's your time. Day. Smooth and easy water climb. Lonely strike, lonely strike. A peaceful moment you light. Light one up, feel so free. Lonely strike's the one for me. Lonely strike, oh, what delight, smooth and perfect for your night. And it's toasting. Sponsored by Lonely Strike. Previous episode of Scary Shadow Spot Last Farewell. We saw the wife in the coffin. She died in a terrible, tragic... Oh, okay, we're back. Hey there. Hi, honey. Oh. <sighs> honey, you're back. There's a demon chasing me around the house, honey. Can you help me? Those are real cigarettes? Oh. What, what was that? <laughs> I'm so confused. I got the key. 
attic key. But oh, that's where the ghost was dancing. No one's dancing now. That sucks. I really wanted to dance with her. What's that? More rosary. Another vinyl. <coughs> Wait, what? <coughs> Why am I? Okay, okay, okay. Up, down, down, up, 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 down, down, up, down, down. Okay, power's out. I mean, power's back. Hope you are well. Absolutely doing great. So this was the first picture that we found. Oh, it just goes anywhere. Sure, that helps. But these are all the pictures we have found first. Tell me. Tell me. Hello, Mark. Hi. It's Dr. Will again. You were in a very special room. Jane was a few months pregnant when the accident happened. Okay. This was supposed to be your child's room, a place full of hopes and dreams. I know how hard it is to face this double loss. I want you to reflect on something important. Sometimes to overcome the pain, we need to open our eyes and see the truth, even if it hurts. Find what you are looking for and keep it with you. Also, there is a flashlight in this room that will be useful for exploring the attic. I got that. Keep being strong, Mark. Every step brings you closer to the truth and peace. Anything else, Doc? We'll talk again on the next record. We can talk right now, you know. Let me light a candle to set the mood. There. Tell me. Tell me more. Hello, Mark. Hi. It's Dr. Will. How are you doing? I know all of this may seem confusing and your thoughts might be a mess. It's normal considering what has happened. If you feel strange or have visions, call me immediately. You don't have to face everything alone. What's the number? I want to talk to you about the dear woman. I saw I her. know you've had visions of her. No. I want you to know that this figure represents Jane. Really? It was a deer that caused the accident by suddenly crossing the road. Your mind is trying to process this trauma, and the dear woman is a manifestation of Jane in that fateful moment. In the kitchen, you will find a Ouija board. Yeah. This can be a tool to contact the other world. Someone might be trying to communicate with you, Let's and do you it. shouldn't ignore these calls. The Ouija board can help you establish contact. The word you need to enter to contact Jane is Veritas. Remember this word. It Veritas. will be the key to communicating with okay. her. Okay. I got that. Veritas. Remember that, guys, okay? Hi, Ashutosh. Welcome. Stay strong, Mark. Every step you take brings you closer to the truth and peace. Talk to you on the next record. Don't I need a glass or something for that? I think I need a glass to communicate. Okay. Looks like I'm good. I have these red, blue, and yellow candles. Uh, yeah. Let's go talk to Jane. Aha, very funny game. Ah, okay. Nice. We got it. We got it. We got it. Bedroom key. Is this the bedroom? Is that's not the bedroom? Oof. That took me only like the bedroom key. Is this the bedroom? Nope. Pray, guys. Perfect. Alright, got that. Wait, 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 there, there was not a wall here. 
There was not a wall here, guys. What's going on here? Shut up. Honey? What are you doing, honey? Honey, don't do that. Oh no, the fuse box again, bro. Oh my god. She's not there. She's not there. <laughs> 